Perez family shows how desperately we need immigration reform now. A man with 23 years in the United States is facing deportation. If the community loses Gustavo, we'll lose a taxpayer, we'll lose a business in a time when Detroit needs every single dollar it can get. His house might go into foreclosure. Does Detroit need any more abandoned homes and foreclosed homes? No. And what will happen to his four children, all of whom are U.S. citizens? Getting this right isn't just a human rights issue. It's not just about one family. It's about the survival of the city of Detroit. We know that an attack against one of us is an attack against all of us. That's why the Metro Detroit AFL-CIO is standing with the Vargas family and with the movement for immigration reform. Thanks to all the community for your support, for being here to support us. A todas las iglesias, all the churches, a todos los sindicatos que defienden a las familias, all the labor unions that defense the families. We are learning to get together to tell our stories. Estamos aprendiendo a perder el miedo. We are learning to um, not to fear. We are fighting today not only for me, not only for my family, sino por las, los millones de familias que merecen estar juntas. But for also for the millions of families that need to be united also. No importa lo que pase. It doesn't matter what happens. Lucharemos juntos. We will fight together. Somos más fuertes. And we are more stronger. Y continuaremos uh, luchando hasta ganar. And we will continue to struggle until we win. Woo! Gracias a todos por su apoyo. Thank you so much for your support.